Welcome in, Max. We'll go ahead and open it up for questions. All righty. Hey, guys. A little different. Hey, Max. What uh, Max, Alex and Snit have both talked about how, you know, the plan is to piggyback the starters uh, the first couple of times through. What, what are your thoughts on that? Would that limit you and, and you know, or do you really understand uh, the reasoning behind the team doing this? Uh, I mean, obviously, this whole thing is – new for everyone so uh, we're kind of my approach right now is just kind of take it day by day and uh you know see how we're feeling obviously this is unprecedented territory so um i'm gonna go out there and get ready for a season like a normal normal season try to build up but uh you know we'll, we'll kind of take this thing day by day uh, is anybody else having a hard time hearing max or yeah yeah uh, is there anything we can do about that? Thank you, Ty, guys. Let's see if we can fix the audio here. Test, test. How's that sound? Testing? That's a little better right there. Yeah. Hello. Thank you. Matt Max, how did you feel out there today? I mean, did it, did it feel good? And, and can you, you know, how close can you come to simulating adrenaline when, when facing teammates? Uh, I tried to treat it like a like a normal start. We had the music going. Obviously, everyone had their, you know, walkouts. But um, I obviously – I don't know how it's going to feel when we get out there and, you know, the first game happens and there's no one in the stands. But I tried to treat it as, as much of – the regular season games I could, you know, same routine beforehand, uh, you know, pregame routine, come in the dugout, uh, you know, run out on the field with everyone. So we tried to, uh, you know, mimic a real game as much as we could. Max, you had the, uh, the three guys were working out here, uh, Fulte, Nuke, and, uh, and uh, ooh, I can't even think. Uh, but what did you do out in California? Who, what, what were your workouts like during the shutdown out there? Uh, I was working out uh, in the backyard. Uh, I was I was I was in Los Angeles. I was uh, just hanging with my parents and my family back home. My brother just graduated college, so we would work out in the backyard together. And then, uh, luckily enough, I was able to kind of have a throwing partner in uh, Jack Flaherty. So we were able to kind of play catch and you know throw bullpens. We did, ended up doing lives together, but um, yeah, just try to stay as ready as possible. Pretty good throwing partner. Yeah, not too bad. <laughs> hey, hey, Max. A couple couple months ago, we had to uh, run a poll on like you know what what who does the fan base hate the most? And I don't know if you saw some of those responses with the guys coming out to say Flaherty. You know, I mean Bryce Harper got his fair share, but uh, did you have fun with Flaherty with that? I mean, did, did you poke? Uh, I mean, did you say anything to him about it? I I, I didn't know that honestly. Um, uh, but, you know, at the end of the day, we're competitors going out there and trying to win. So uh, if, if our fan base doesn't doesn't like him, then he's pretty sure he's doing his job. And I'm, I'm sure that, you know, a lot of the, the Cardinals fans don't like a lot of us. So it's just all part of it. It's, you know, part of the game. And at the end of the day, we're all at, uh, competitors and athletes going out there trying to win. Where did you guys work out together? Uh, we're, we were able to, you know, find some fields and whatever and, we're luckily enough to go to Harvard Westlake and be able to use Oh, Westlake. You feel good? Yeah, no, I feel great. Yeah, ready to go. I'm just kind of been chomping at the bit. I didn't realize how much I missed the competition. And Max, Max Nitz said it kind of felt of, like. Go ahead, Bob. Just kind of go off of what, uh, what Mark was saying earlier about adrenaline. Uh, to, be, to be fair to your response, I mean, there were no fans out there today. Um, and this was kind of a game simulation. Is this? Uh, I mean, just kind of how do you get yourself up when there isn't that, that energy in the park? Have you figured that out yet? Um, I, I spent a lot of years where, you know, you don't have a ton of fans in, in the minor leagues and the low minors. I spent, you know, parts of three different years in low A. So, like, you don't, some, sometimes you don't get a lot of fans. And at that point, you have to try to figure out the, of ways to get yourself up and be able to compete, at, you know, at your highest level. So, knowing that that guy's stepping in the box and uh you know he's trying to do damage and 
know, trying to hit me, then that gives me all the motivation I need to kind of get myself up and get going. Max, were you at all surprised how sharp you were today? Yeah, I don't know how many uh, live VPs, if you threw any any during the shutdown at all, but were you, because you look good from the, from the get-go today. Were you surprised at all? Um, I'm, I'm happy with where I'm at right now. Um, I don't know if surprise is the right word. I've, I've been working really hard this, uh, you know, this quarantine as far as like my delivery and uh, just trying to, you know, fine tune things. And I've been throwing a n number of live VPs when, before I came out, probably through four. So I definitely had gotten, you know, seen swings on, you know, my pitches and everything. Uh, obviously it's a little different when you come into this atmosphere, but um, I feel ready to go and just excited to kind of get this thing rolling. When, you know, when you left spring training, you know, you, you were thinking, you know, you had worked on some things. Was, was there anything that, that you were happy it, it has advanced from where it was in March to where it is now? Uh, yeah, I think just the stuff that I've been fighting of just staying more athletic in my delivery, staying back. Um, I worked a ton on my changeup, and I felt like I threw a couple really good ones today, and that's making progress. So just trying to, you know, fine tune things, get ready for the season, because you know we don't have too many more outings before, you know, game one. So uh, just trying to make sure that I'm game ready, and uh, at this point, it's just all about competing. Any more questions, for Max? I know you fished interleague games before, but your um... What's your opinion on going into a season with the DH and no chances for it that? It's going to be a little different. Obviously, you, you don't have that pitcher at the end of the lineup and you've got another hitter. So um, it obviously changes things. But at the end of the day, you like, can't change the way that you're going to go about your outings or the way you pitch. Um, it's just an extra guy in there that you know might hit more full time. So let's just go out there, execute your pitches, and just try to win ball games. It's kind of keeping it as simple as possible. Any last ones? Okay, thanks, Max. Thanks. Awesome. See you guys.